So I've got this question a couple of times about how do you turn off event hawk if you're like busy or uh, let's say it's the holiday and you don't want to text anybody for one day. How do you, what's the best way to turn off event hawk for an hour, for a day or, or, or whatever? Uh, so the answer to that question is it's really not something that's meant to be turned off. Uh, you're supposed to set event hawk on a schedule, for example, your business hours and uh, it's, it's customer service, it's sales. So it's not meant to be ever turned off. You know, when somebody fills out this form, we should be getting back to them uh, upon the schedule that you preset. Uh, so there is no direct answer as to how to shut this thing off because it's not meant to be shut off. However, there is a way to do this. It's kind of a workaround. Um, and to do this, you're gonna go to uh, marketing and you're gonna go to campaigns. So campaigns is essentially your automations, okay? So the, the only way to do this, and again, it's not because not, it's, it's kind of a, a workaround, is you need to turn off the campaigns and then turn them back on. Now these campaigns don't have on and off buttons because again, that's, they're not meant to be turned off. Uh, but instead of deleting them, all you would do is go into each campaign and just put it into draft. Okay, so we put this campaign into draft, this campaign into draft, this campaign into draft. Okay, now we see that um, all these campaigns are in draft. You can see here the status. If anybody fills out the form, no automatic text messaging will go out, no automatic emails will go out, nothing will happen until you turn these campaigns back on. So let's say, you know, it's a holiday, you want to turn them off for a day or an hour or whatever. You put everything in draft, then you go back in and you put it all in, uh, in published status. Once you do that, it's not going to message everybody automatically. It's going to message them once that time frame hits. So let's say you have your campaign set to message people between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. And you turn them off and then you turn them back on at, uh, you know, 7 p.m. If you turn everything back on at 7 p.m., all these people that have been sitting there waiting for the campaign to be turned back on again, they're not going to get a text at 7 p.m. They're going to get a text at 9 a.m. the next day because you turned the campaign on uh, when it fell out of the schedule. Uh, if you turn on the campaign between the hours of 9 and 5, for example, that's what you had it set to, it's going to go ahead and, uh, and message them immediately. So um, that's the best way to do it. It works. It should work. I mean, let me know if you guys have any issues with it, but it should just not send out any automations. And then once you turn it back on, those automations should go out. So you don't have to manually uh, re-message anybody or worry about anybody falling through the cracks. All right. Good luck, guys.